Hello guys, welcome again to ECZ. In this video, I am going to show you how to import your motion graphics mode RT from MISKIT to your Premiere Pro and how to use it and affect it appropriately. So, if you want to do this, let's go. All I need to do is simply go to MISKIT and you can go from here, Templates, Premiere Pro or you can go down here premiere pro so these are the various templates okay let's work with one of these templates which is the subscribe templates let me open it this has different templates that you can choose from the subscribe button different templates so you can choose any of them so for example this is the one i have chosen let me show you how it is here so once i play this video now although it's not much but you will see it appear here look at it appear here you know why it's appearing going through but this thing that is from my grammar case i have to increase it let's go back all you need to do is to click on it once you click on it it will open up and you click on download template once download it it will now go to your folder okay download folder then you can extract it it must come as a template and a zip file so all you need to do is to unzip it this is the zipped one and you unzip it and this is all it comes with this is what we need the mock RT. so let me show you swiftly how to import it to your premiere pro let's quickly head over to premiere pro in your premiere pro this is the editing tab you move from the editing tab to the effect tab so you can have more of these features showcased okay so long as we are here you click on motion graphics it will come up so the motion graphics are up on your graphics essential tab you have the browse and the edit so you go to the browse under the browse you come down here and you see this plus sign here you click on it once you click on it it will take you to your down on your folder if it doesn't do that you just click on your download tab and you see the mob rot which you then click on open and it will be inserted under the essential library on the graphic essential if you are new to motion graphics or using motion graphics in premiere pro you might not see it appear here so all you need to do is to go to the sort bar here and select recent most times if you're using it for the first time it will be set under sort by title okay so what you do is to select recent so that when you screw up here you will see it appear here the next thing you need to do i want to show is how to place it here very easy all you need to do is to press down your left mouse button or hold down your left mouse button and move it down to your timeline and automatically it will be applied and once you play your video across it it will be displayed okay now it looks somehow big to edit it all you need to do is to move over to the edit tab here and you can choose from the coloration here and you can play around with it and you get a color that you want you can also change the positions this light here you can change the light and choose to limit whatever you want or also change the font same thing applies to the subscribed which we apply shortly once you click on it you will see it there subscribed so you can also click on it okay and also work on the positions so to reduce the size of this all you need to do is to head over to editing pan under the editing pan you double click on it it will be highlighted okay so you can move around with it and you can set it either on the left side, the right side, top left, top right and even in the middle and you can also choose to reduce it depending on the one you want. Okay, so this method applies to all other Premiere Pro, Miss Kit, Mog, Aruti, Essential, Graphics items. I believe you've learned something from this video. If you have kindly like and subscribe and also share this video so that when I publish video like this you'll be first to see it and learn from it until then see you